horses for race number six, the first division this afternoon for three-year-old Philly Pacers. Second leg of Ohio Sire Sticks action, racing one mile, a purse of $14,000. A field of eight, the six horse is a late scratch. Number one is TM Good Time Woman, a daughter of Merger, with a mark of 158 and two, owned by Tom and Marsha Janecki of Perrysburg, Ohio. Jim Mullinex driving. Number two, Dorothy Newman. Here is a daughter of Falcon Elmerhurst. With a three year record of 159 and two. Owned by Gary Mallory of Noblesville, Indiana. Dave Miller, the driver. Three is Sister Rhodey, another daughter of Falcon Elmerhurst. With a two year old record, 201 and three. Owned by Laura Samuels, Korean and Gloria Sinai of Ohio. Chip Noble, the driver. Number four, Tucson Gwenny. Here is a daughter of Tucson Hanover with a three-year record of 201 and two. Owned by Edwin Lane of Kettering with Sam Coven. Five is Jazzy Jackie Ann, another daughter of Tucson Hanover with a mark of 158 and two. Owned by Mark Klotz and Jeanette Dar of Ohio. Mark Klotz with the lines. Six is Scratch. Seven is Happy Sims, daughter of Simcoe Hanover with a record of 157 and four at Maywood Park in Chicago. Owned by Stanley Crow and Martin Crow of Ohio. Jurassic Junior drives. Eight is Kimmy Lowe, daughter of Tucson Hanover, with a mark of 159 at Northfield Park. Oh, by Terry Gillen and Richard Fuller of Massillon, Ohio, Ray Fisher, Jr. And the nine is Princess First, daughter of Noble and Sam, with a two-year-old mark of two minutes and four. Oh, by Alan Dupler, Peggy Dupler, and Mike Matters of Ohio, Brad Hanners, in the sulky. One play show, they swing to the back stretch for the start. Second leg of Ohio Sires, and there they go. And they're off. It's the chestnut jazzy Jackie Ann firing hard for the lead. Happy Sims from the outside came away second. Kimmy Lowe from the outside is away third. Tucson Gwenny angles in quickly fourth. Dorothy Newman racing a fifth off the rail sixth. TM Good Time Woman. Parked early sixth is Princess first. Uh, the trailer is Sister Rhodey as they approach the first quarter. Happy Sims with the lead, but she's looking for Kimmy Lowe who will take command here. At the first quarter, a quick 27 and three, and Kimmy Lowe has circled from the far outside. She'll take the lead by a length. Happy Sims at the leader's heels is second. Jassy Jackie Ann is third. Out of the outside fourth, here comes Sister Rhodey, co-favorite. Gap to cover fifth comes TM Good Time Woman. Tucson Gwinnett caught on the shuffle is locked in sixth. Princess first gets underway seventh, and now the trailer shuffled far back is Dorothy Newman. Reaching the half now, and Kimmy Lowe is under attack. The half in 58 seconds. Outside, Sister Rhodey is pressuring two. Happy Sims along the rail is third. Jazzy Jackie Ann is fourth. Gapping covered by three lengths. Five, TM Good Time Woman. Tucson Gwinnie to the outside. Into the passing lane now is pacing sixth. As they race on towards the three quarters. And on the front, Kimmy Lowe getting a slight breather here. Sister Rhodey is still there, pressuring two, but she's beginning to tire now. And here comes Tucson Gwenny from the outside. Three quarters, 128 and one. Kimmy Lowe remains on top. She leads by length. Happy Sims has yet to move his second. Tucson Gwenny now is up and pacing a third. Jazzy Jackie Ann. And here comes Dorothy Newman moving between horses as they turn for home. Less than an eighth of a mile ago. And down the stretch they come. Kimmy Lowe. Top choice has a lead by two. Jazzy Jackie Ann to the inside is coming to her. Mid stretch, Kimmy Lowe, Jazzy Jackie Ann in that order. Kimmy Lowe in front. 159. Introducing the official winner, the first division for three old Philly Pacers in the, the second leg of Ohio Sires. Coming in from Northfield Park, number eight is Kimmy Lowe. A chestnut daughter of the hot Philly sire Tucson Hanover from the Nero Stardam medley. Oh, by Terry Gillen and Richard Full of Massillon, Ohio. Robert Belcher, the uh, trainer, Ray Fisher Jr. in the Sonke. Kimmy Law remains undefeated in Ohio sire stakes action, winning her first leg at Lebanon by four and two minutes. Coming right back here this afternoon, winning the second leg. She's two of two in Ohio sires. This her fourth season's victory, equaling her career mark this afternoon. 159.